Much. That's awesome. I'm happy with that. Punk! Oh, hell. Apparently he's injured, guys. Apparently it's not looking very good. Oh, he's out here with a sling on. He looks furious. Oh, man, this isn't good. This mania is cursed, man. Like, first we had Seth. Now Punk. It's cool, Punk signing a little kid's belt. That's awesome. Apparently he injured it off the uh, Future Shock DDT from Drew. Which sucks, man. The universe just does not want Seth and Punk happening at Mania. <laughs> it's just... Something's messing with this match. Seth is probably only just going to make it to Mania and Punk probably not at all. Oh man, this is WrestleMania 40 and Punk's going to miss it. I'm pretty sure with his injury, um, I can't quite remember what he's got, but I'm pretty sure it's a four to six month injury. I think it might be a, a tear in his arm somewhere. Um, I'm not quite sure. Uh, what's he going to say? The CM Punk chants. This is wild, man. Who ever thought we'd see CM Punk back in WWE, let alone the night after, sorry, two nights after the Royal Rumble and being a runner-up. And now he's injured having to give this promo. Oh, no, what a shot. No. This is making me feel some type of way. Punk staring at the WrestleMania sign. Looking heartbroken. Oh man, this just sucks, man. I feel for Punk, dude. Like, let's see what he's got to say. I came real close Saturday night. And I felt like I had it in the palm of my hand. Clear it up a bit. And I'm not mad at anybody, really. I'm not mad at Cody Rhodes. I actually would like to take this time off the top to say congratulations to Cody. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Respect, sportsmanship. A lot of the love to see in it. this business is not about what you deserve. It's about what you've earned, and he's earned it. He's busted his ass. I hope he goes to WrestleMania in Philadelphia and he finishes his story. Yes. I can't wait for that, man. Going so back hyped. to back in the Rumble is a hell of an accomplishment. It's kind of like your Tampa Bay Lightning going back to back winning the cup. <laughs> and while I came close, close don't count in this business. Close only counts in horseshoes and hand grenades. And I've never believed in luck. God, Punk's so good on the mic, man. But I feel a little bit unlucky. In the course of the rumble, I tore my right tricep. Oh, that's right. Yeah, tricep. Tore his tricep. And as much as I tried and I asked, maybe I could just tape it. You know, maybe, maybe I could make it to Elimination Chamber and I could try to win that and I can, I can get my main event at WrestleMania. Uh, that's right, he was going to Aussie. But it's just not in the cards. And I don't want anybody to feel sorry for me. This sucks, man. This because when sucks. I think of this situation and how much it bums me out, how much I have talked from the highest mountains about how my goal and my dream ever since I was a little kid was to main event WrestleMania. You know, maybe it's just not. Yes, that's done. right. He never got to when he was here on his first run, and that was the whole problem. He wanted to main, wanted to main event Mania. I don't want anybody to feel sorry for me because, realistically, is this a problem? Now, I have a friend, Mania 40. Named Chad Gilbert, who I think about a lot. Every day I think about this kid because I love him to death, and he's got cancer, and he's had it real bad for a long time. 
Shit. He's got a beautiful wife, a beautiful daughter named Lily, and I'll go visit him and I'll sit with him while he gets his chemotherapy. And he's always in a good mood. Gosh, this is giving me goosebumps, man. It. Punks and so tears. Crushing. That's a fight. To me, this is just a flesh wound. When I say best in the world, it doesn't mean because I always win. I lose more often than I win. You guys see me fight in the UFC? Yeah, not great. I had a dream, and I had an opportunity, and I was asked, do you want to do this? And I said yes, because it scared the crap out of me. <laughs> Hell yeah. God, he is like... Got tears in his eyes and it's making me... Like, even I was like... Oh, I got goosebumps, man. I feel like I'm holding back tears. WrestleMania scares me. It's a goal that might haunt me for the rest of my life. But this is just a bump in the road. Best in the world is those people who fight things like cancer. People who put their lives on the line, like Matt Flanagan in Chicago, who's a firefighter. People who help other people. Now me, I just happen to entertain you. For some reason, you people love me. <laughs> we do. It's true. And I promise I'm going to keep doing it until the wheels fall off. This is a bump in the road. It is adversity, and I have overcome adversity countless times in the past. I do not focus on those who are negative. I do not focus on those who tell me I can't. I'm not tall enough. I'm not big enough. You got stupid hair. You got the wrong tattoos. None of that matters. You tell us it's just punk, like you, just 100% authentically day, punk. Wake up. And your teachers and your garbage men. And it doesn't matter what you do because you wake up and you keep going. You put food on your family's table, and by God, that's exactly what I'm going to do. I love punk, man. 40, I guess it's not in the cards, ladies and gentlemen. But I'm a Chicago Cubs fan. And this isn't the first time, and it won't be the last time I say this. There's always next year. Oh, God, this. I'm going to bust my head. Drew! Not what I was expecting. He was expecting to say the word ass. He's going to bust his ass to get back. What a phenomenal message. Punk WrestleMania 41. Oh, that sucks, dude. Obviously, it's still a mania. It doesn't matter, but it's just this is such a big mania. Mania 40. <laughs> it's got Drew McIntyre eliminated by CM Punk from 2024 Royal Rumble. That's right. I forgot he threw him out of there. And ironically, Drew's the one that injured him. Well, not injured him. We won't say that because that's not fair. <laughs> I actually don't know how it happened. I know I'm pretty sure it was off the Future Shock DDT. I might have to watch it back because I don't actually I don't actually see how we got injured. I actually respect Punk so much, man. Like, and genuinely, I actually have to thank him and like I've gained so much more respect and love for him, especially since uh, if you follow me on Instagram, Sam Punk shared my Instagram reel on his story uh, back in November when he returned. Punk's holding the mic up like ready to ready to smack him one. <laughs> he's only got one arm because he's got one in the sling. But yeah, um, my reaction video, Punk returning, he shared it on his story and like, man, I cannot thank Punk enough because that reel is almost up to half a million views because of him, literally just because of him. I've said some terrible things about you since you returned to WWE. And I meant them. You're a terrible person to me in the past. I think you're a poison to the locker room, but I'm listening to you now and I can relate wow. to everything you're saying. So he's going to start off semi nice and then 
I've had my dreams taken away from me as well. I was fired from this place, and when I was listening to you talk with your buddy Chad, I can relate to that as well. <clears throat> I don't know, you know what I believe in. I went through some changes recently myself. I've never been much of a spiritual person. I love this. It feels so authentic. I want you to know this. I prayed for this and it happened. Wow. Yeah, I was right. <laughs> it's going to start off all right and then he was going to get a bit more heelish. When I get into that rumble, I targeted you. I violently assaulted you. I can Making a story out of it, nice. That thing. Our champion, he's went down. He's taken the title as far as he could till his body broke. He's done a great job. Who's going to take it to the next level? I couldn't let it be you. I could see them and doing Drew and Seth Mania. I couldn't sleep that night and I was so angry with myself. Then I heard the news the next day. And I slept like a baby last night. Wow. <laughs> Drew's gone full heel you mode. You won the battle, but you didn't win the war. Mission accomplished. I exorcised the demon CM Punk. Now I'm going to find a way into the world title match at WrestleMania. And I'm going to go to the main event. And I'm gonna live CM Punk's dream again. Jeez. Wow. I would not mind seeing a program between Punk and uh, Drew when he gets back. Drew's another one that's so solid on the mic, man. Pretty sure Drew just re signed with WWE as well. Don't lower those eyes. Look me in the eyes when you speak to me, please. Punk walking up to Drew, face to face. My heart hurts more than my tricep does. I'm going to go rehab it, and when I come back, I will main event WrestleMania, but the first checklist is you. I'm coming right for you. Oh, nice. The only positive I feel like comes out of this. I mean, it's not a positive because it still sucks. Punk's missing mania. Oh! oh. Oh my god! This is weird. This makes it look like a storyline injury. Sammy! Oh my gosh! More people! Nice. Whoa! That pop! That let's go was so loud. What a crowd. I feel so bad, man. We were so gutted when Sammy entered number 30 in the Rumble. See, this is why you can't have expectations for big people because it just it makes you disappointed for people that are genuinely really talented and really good. Because I love Sammy. I don't have anything against him. I think he's phenomenal. It's only that we were, you know, getting too much into the rumors. Like, oh, is it going to be Rock? Is it going to be Okada, MJF? Stuff like that. That it made us, you know, disappointed for when Sammy was number 30. 